in last video y'all told me Yuji was gonna be on that type of timing so the next time Yuji fights and he's really about that I'll start that video with a formal apology I'm not even gonna lie to y'all I was definitely one of those people who put Yuji on the fraud watch after he got his ass beat in the bathroom but as of today December 7th 2023 Yuji Itadori is now officially the number one suspect on the fraud watch list I know I made some of y'all mad, but hear me out. Yuji went crazy last episode. He put up insane numbers that game. That boy dropped a triple-double called that nigga Westbrook. But he always got to jump a nigga to win. Now, before y'all even say it, yes, I know it's JJK. Nobody's playing fair. But I would still like to see Yuji queue it for a solo game. Why he always got to play duos? Anyways, we get right into the episode and we see the aftermath of Nobra. Now, if I'm being real with you, ain't no way she dead. Everybody else who died this season went out brutally. Unless the Arthur really hates Nobra and just wants to see her go outside she'll be alright you just gotta rock the nick fury so yuji started crying but mahito just saw that as an opportunity ran up talking about how he found his ability and i was like the fuck is he talking about and then this dude said black flash and he must think he piccolo the way he tossed him to that wall then he tossed him again and i kid you not bro deadass told him this ain't no damn fairy tale shit is not sweet now one thing about mahito is that he always gets his get back that beating he got last episode is the only thing on his mind then he walked up on yuji called that nigga his twin and started beating his ass and just when he's about to murk yuji the moment I heard that clap, I knew what time it was. It's time for the big bro to get into the mix. He looked at Yuji and was like, nigga, get your weak ass up. Now, I know I've been talking crazy about Yuji, but I gotta give him some slack. He's mad young witnessing his homie die right in front of him. Not to mention, anytime Sukuna takes his body over, he has to worry about him terrorizing the country just for the hell of it. But Mahito doesn't care for that soft shit. He's running Yuji down, but Toto was like, yeah, we is not doing that. And look at his face. He's like, this is what y'all had to deal with with these last couple episodes? This disrespectful ass nigga interrupting dialogue and shit? He ran back in but total hit him with a teleport into a mean boot to the head. So that's when homeboy came through, helped Yuji with his injuries and was like, just make sure you're ready to jump that nigga. But Toto was already in the mix. Ran in with the slide cancel to the handstand kick. But while he was up there, he took a chunk out the ceiling, came back down with a kick, but that's easy reads. Through the ceiling, but Toto broke through it, spun the block with a whole scythe in his hand, but that teleport ability is an S ring skill bro can really forcefully put you anywhere on the map so mahito tried to do his level one beyblade move but with the whole attack then total was about to come through with the punish but mahito made his body into a trap he was like oh so you playing like a bitch teleported behind him and then he teleported again just to make him look goofy he did that just to talk shit too but mahito was one step ahead with that landmine and he must have thought he was a harvard graduate thinking he can read toto he should know by now if there's ever more than one sorcerer on the field it instantly becomes a tag team match my head wasn't in the game, but I'm back now. Don't worry, Nanami. This get back finna be devious. Oh, and also, don't you ever steal my move again, ho. What the fuck? Then Toto walked up, ripped his shirt for whatever reason, and it was time to get active. But before that, we got this little seat of Mechamaru talking to Miwa, and she asked why he only sent Toto over there. Am I just too weak? He pretty much was like, nah, you're not weak. You're just not toto but right after he was kind of confessing his feelings but sadly his batteries died battery is low please recharge in time but enough of that we back to the main event mahito over here playing whack-a-mole with these niggas and this has to be top five duo of all time because peep game mahito is about to smack yuji but toto switched with him last second to block it switched again so yuji can run him with the drop kick then teleported above him and toto alley yuked him straight into mahito so they fell into this underground station and mahito is probably the only person who can somewhat counter yuji's s tier jumping skill because he can deadass make shadow clones but now peep this went after toto but he teleported grabbed yuji then threw him but we can't forget mahito got the gum gum fruit now they weaving all his hits but look how toto kicked him in his face he spun the block just to get hit with a knee then switched places with yuji so he can get a couple licks into they dead just use his body as a soccer ball so they ended up breaking down into a stage transition and maybe i'm dragging it but don't this look a little familiar but now Mahito's plan was to kill Toto first. And bro made a whole train. And whenever there's people around, Mahito was pretty much using cheat codes. Bro really said slash spawn sword. So then he turned two more people into swords and now was chasing down Toto. He jumped across, boosted off the wall, but Mahito said, Weak. came back in, but was instantly forced to block. Mahito then created a hand to touch Toto, but he teleported away. But hold on. How did he switch places when his hands were blocking the swords? Nah, cause now I need to know. But anyways, he ended up knocking him into the elevator and somehow 
press the up button so yuji finally made it into the mix toto handed that man a rock and he sent that flying toto switched places with the rock and said yeah yeah is not finna overtake me bro really went to his my hero academia duffer with this one hit that man with a crazy black flash the only thing i'm kind of annoyed about is that you gave him that crazy animation just for the dude absolutely nothing but that's when they revealed that all three of them reached 120 percent of their potential whatever that means then mahito started spamming his attacks and i'm not even gonna hold you i kind of mess with mahito bro even after all the stuff he's done i realized that he's just a pure villain and i kind of mess with that but yeah man whoever is mahito's voice actor give that nigga an oscar